How you guys doing? Thank you so much for the time. You got it. How you doing, Robert? I'm doing well. Really excited. I'm uh, before I moved to LA. I'm born and raised in St. Louis. So, oh wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. So this is my late teens, early twenties when all this was going on. So you guys are like royalty uh, to <laughs> me. <laughs> I don't know. Don't 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 put us there, Robert. Trust me. <laughs> well, my first question actually is for you, uh, Mrs. Warner. When when I walked into the the theater to watch the movie, I thought it was going to be your standard, you know, Kurt Warner football jock movie, and I came out of the theater thinking. Man, Brenda Warner is an amazing uh, woman, and so many people are going to be inspired by this. Could you just let us know, when you watched the movie, did it really capture your journey? Because you went through a lot, and you stayed strong, and you're just an amazing woman, and I think it's really going to inspire a lot of people. Well, thank you. Thank you for those kind words. Mm -hmm. Um, You know, I know um, that when I was young and dreamed what I was going to be, I didn't think I'd be sitting here. Um, I didn't also believe that I would go through as many hard times. I had this faith that I thought, oh, if I believe, then everything's going to be easy and good. And um, I just think by showing my story that you see that my faith was there when it wasn't easy also. Um, That matters to me because it's easy to believe when everything's going well. Um, but when, when you're burying your parents or when, you know, you're taking your son to the doctor, um, a lot of things like that, that that's where you find out who you really are. So I think they did a great job. I'm proud of how they represented me. They made me look really good. Um, I don't know about all that, but I appreciate you seeing that side of it. Uh, no problem. And, and Kurt, not to spoil the movie or anything, but you had some tough conversations there with some coaches in college and early on in your career, especially I think the 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 scene that really gets me is the one with Steve Mariucci. And obviously you've worked with Mooch in, 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 in the NFL network. How was that conversation like once you got to the Rams and had some success when you ran into Mooch again? <laughs> Robert, it's all fun now, right? It's, <laughs> it's all, you know, but we were actually just talking yesterday and I told him like, you're a big reason why this movie happened because it was in him cutting me or, or the Packers cutting me that really took me on this journey. But we were also talking about that scene. And the natural thing I think for all of us is when we get close to our dream, like I was in that moment to go, oh, I'm ready. I got this. You know, I'm everything I need to be to be able to achieve my dreams. That was a moment for me that said, Kurt, you're not ready. I I know you think you are, but you're not there yet. There's, There's more that you have to do if you truly wanna be ready for, for this opportunity, this platform that you've been given. And so that was one of those moments for me. Now I'm extremely grateful, Robert, that I got a second chance, right? Cause I could have blown my one moment, but it was moments like that throughout the movie that makes you stop and go, okay, I need to realistically look at this thing and where do I need to grow to become the person that I wanna be? Could have been our relationship together. Could have been me as a father, me as a football player. Uh, but yes, definitely one of those moments in a football context that makes, I think should make all of us step back and go, you know what? Sometimes we're not ready. And it comes down to us having to do what we need to do to make sure we're prepared for those moments when they come later in life. Well, you know, it's a beautiful movie and I hope a lot of people see it. It's coming at the perfect time around the holidays when people struggle with loss and things like that. I believe both of you and the movie are an inspiration to everyone. So thank you very much for the time and bless you and have a happy, a happy holiday to you and all of your kids as well. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Robert. Great to talk right. to you. All right. Bye-bye.